Where MDC is mentioned, what exactly is the MDC? MDC is a short form for Micro Data Center. Before we proceed further, let us take a look at the conventional data center. A conventional data center is a building with dedicated areas to house all the computer system, data, and necessary components. The building consists of basic functional services such as the air conditioning, environment monitoring, electrical, fire protection, and security access. The NDC houses all the basic functional services in a building to be contained into a rack. A common issue faced with the conventional data centers are integration between multiple sensors. For MDCs, temperature, humidity, water detections, smoke alarm, and door contact monitoring systems are all integrated in the factories. This effectively emulates all the unnecessary integrations on site. Options to integrate with the existing monitoring systems are also available. At the bottom of the rack, we have an in-rack cooling module. For the conventional DC's air conditioning crack units are usually larger in size and requires much more piping connection works. For the conventional cooling modules, they are usually designed based on the overall room size, which definitely consume more energy. As compared to MDCs, the cooling module is in the rack, hence it is smaller in size and requires minimal maintenance. Furthermore, there is no need for an outdoor condenser unit and for the in-rack cooling capacity, it is designed to target directly at the active equipment within the rack. This results in better OPEX savings for the total cost of ownership. Moving on, we are looking at the power distribution module. For the conventional electrical distribution board, they are usually bigger in size and requires precise site coordination. And for that wireless power distribution module, they are smaller in size and compact. They only requires 3U space here. This allows for time and cost saving and safer electrical works. Next up, we are looking at the in-rack uninterrupted power supply and the battery module. For the UPS module, they are normally sized according to the active equipment power load with 15 minutes backup battery time. And for that while, we provide customization for users that requires longer standby time if required. Just let us know your needs and we can do our best to fulfill your requirement. This is an intelligent PDU with ability to monitor electrical reading and the number of outlets can be customized according to the user requirement. There's also options to have individual outlet monitoring and also remote on and off of the outlet. After introducing all the components of what is within the MDCs, we hope that everyone has a better understanding and knowledge of what is within the MDCs. Finally, let us summarize on what we have covered so far. Point number one, smaller modular components are used in MDCs compared to the conventional DCs. Number two, reduce the capital expenditure during project startup. Number three, minimize the overhead cost for operations and maintenance. And lastly, flexibility with future expansion with zero downtime. We hope you enjoyed the video and thank you for watching.